Welcome to Lakshmi Academy and this is your friend Mahi. Today we are going to discuss about an interesting topic in reasoning that is direction sense test. So let's get started and please don't skip this video for, for better understanding. There are four main directions that are east, south, west and north. Along with these four, there are four cardinals. Those are northeast, southeast, southwest and northwest. You should draw the directions whenever you want to answer the questions. Let's see some examples in the direction sense test. If you see the screen, there is a question regarding a direction sense test. Let me read this first. After starting from a point, A walks 3 km towards east. Then turning to his left, he moves 3 km. After this, he again turns left and moves 3 km in which direction in A from his starting point. So I am assuming A here, this is the starting point. As per the question, A walks 3 km towards east. And then, turning to his left, he moves 3 km again. And then, he again turns left and moves 3 km. Thus, A is in the north position from his starting point. Let's move to the second example. Ankit started walking towards north. After walking 30 meters, he turned towards left and walked 40 meters. He then turned left and walked 30 meters. He again turned left and walked 50 meters. How far is he from his original position? I'm assuming Ankit as A. As per the question, Ankit started walking towards north. After 30 meters, he turned towards left and walked 40 meters. Before that, I'm assuming the endpoint as B. And he turned towards left and walked 40 meters. And I'm assuming the endpoint as C and then turned left and walked 30 meters. I'm taking as D and again turned left and walked 50 meters. I'm dividing the 50 meters as 40 and 10 and I'm taking the end point as E. So as per the question, the distance between A and E that is 10 meters. Let's move to the next example. Lakshman went 15 kilometers to the west from his house, then turned left and walked 20 kilometers. He again turned east and walked 25 kilometers. And finally, turned left and covered 20 kilometers. How far is he now from his house? I'm assuming Lakshman's house here. And I'm taking the starting point as A. As per the question, Lakshman went 15 kilometers to the west from his house. Then turned left and walk at 20 kilometers before that i'm taking the endpoint as b and uh, he turned left and walk at 20 kilometers and i am named as c he again turned east and walk at 25 kilometers and i'm taking the endpoint as d finally turned left and covered 20 kilometers in the final as e so how far is he now from his house before that i'm dividing the cd into two parts basing on the length of AB. So it is 15 and the remaining is 10. Now I am joining A and E. So if you observe here CD equal to B. So as you compare the distance between A and E is 10 kilometers. So these are some examples uh, regarding directions and steps. For this type of questions, just assume yourself in the place of the movable object. Then you can find the answer easily. So this is it from me today. I'll be with an interesting topic on the next Saturday. Till then, keep practicing. Thank you for watching.